update on Jasmine. Let's talk about it. Let's see what's going on. Let me go to the four-hour chart really quickly, and let's go. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so you're above the 618. You tried to do it earlier. No, you tried to do it yesterday, I believe, um, which was this candle right here. You got rejected. It's kind of hard to see because it's such a... It's, on the bigger time frames um but you did have a wick all the way up to 24.3 yeah it came back down all the way down to 21.2 and now you're trying to do it a second time so yes it didn't hold that support but now you're getting the bounce again and we'll see if this can go if you do not get up to 24.5 that's going to be a lower high which is bearish and confirms that you're still in a downtrend even if you're above the 618 in my opinion um usually when you're above the 618 you're bullish but if you get above the 618 and you can't make a higher high I'm going to have to say that's pretty bearish. Um, I can't tell you what I think is going to happen because I thought yesterday you were not going to go below the 618, and it happened. So if I tell you something now, it might not be right. Um, I'm, I'll just tell you what I see on the charts, and that is the 618 that you need to stay above is 22.5, or basically, yeah, 20. Just, uh, what is it? Yes. Yeah. So the 618 is at 22 cents. Um, and then you need, once you're above that, that's step one. Step two is making a higher high above 24.5. If you make a higher high or if you can at least get to 24.5, um, then that's bullish and that's a higher high, even if it's just barely a higher high. Um, but if you can't even have enough power to get up to 24.5, I would say on the macro time frames, that's still bearish and you're still in a downtrend. Even if the bottom is in here at 20 cents, which it very well may be, doesn't mean that. Uh, if you can't give up 24, 24.5, doesn't mean that you guys see any, any more upside until you can push through that level. So, I mean, you could definitely consolidate in toy cents and the low could already be in. But if you can't get through uh, this and make a higher high, I would say that you're probably going to just stay in between uh, 20 cents and 24.5 until, until you break that resistance. So that's basically it. I mean, nothing has changed. I don't think you go below uh, the 0.76 here at, 20, at 21 cents. Um, and if you do, we'll make another video to the downside. If you were to go below that, um, you have a local low down here at 18.5. So with the wicks, at least without the wicks, um, you have a local low down here at 20 cents, which I would think worst case scenario, 18.5 would be the bottom worst case scenario, because if that doesn't hold your next stop is about 12 or 13 cents, uh, 13 cents with the wicks, uh, and 12 cents without the wicks. So that's a, basically it. Um, I would say you just you gotta stay above worst case scenario 22 cents if you don't uh you're probably gonna come down to 18.5 that's all i got I'll see you guys in the next one